What's up, friends of the good boot? This is Manny, and welcome to a new legendary pilot for the Phantom Robot. Her name is Olga Minina, and yet her ability is somehow called Iskra's Devotion. I don't know why. Uh, but let's jump into some battle and show and explain what makes this ability so good. 20% longer duration of the ability on the Phantom Robot is the description. And w this improves actually three things. Because when you activate the ability on the Phantom Robot, you do not only get um, damage resistance, you also get, in addition to that, um, more speed, right? As you see right here. And you also get the teleportation ability. And, uh, and everything is get being made better. 20% longer duration means you can teleport 20% fast uh, further. 20% uh, longer distance teleport, right? Oh, uh, really? It's still going that long, the ability? Oh, wow. Uh, and it also means... Oh, man. Uh, really? Uh, it also means you can uh, run 20% longer. And it also means you can have your resistance 20% longer, okay? So that's a lot of bonuses and plus that this ability has in store for you. Um, having these 20% longer is really, really a big change. So let's see if we can get this guy here with the uh, dodging and speed of the Phantom and make it impossible for him to win this. Uh-oh, I just lost uh, lost my uh, quantum radar, so I cannot no longer attack him. Okay, I'm gonna teleport. I don't know where it went. Oh, <laughs> I end up at the exact same spot I was at before. Wonderful. All right, so uh, this is the, the new phantom ability, the legendary pilot called M uh, Olga Minina, I think, yeah. Uh, and uh, Miskras, Viskras Devotion, or whatever the name of the thing, thing is. A really, really, really strong ability making this pilot so much more useful now. Oh, uh, this robot. It, well, it was already a good robot before, but now it's just even more crazy, you know? The Phantom is one of the tougher, uh, tougher robots in the game at this moment. Um, with its resistance and, and its speed, it's very, very good. All right, I'm gonna use the, the resistance here, because I really need it. Uh, everybody's attacking me right now, but if I'm lucky, I might be able to get out of this with both kills. One kill, and here is the second one. Boom. Nice. And this guy is out of my reach at this moment. Uh, but maybe afterwards. He just used his ability, and see how fast the ability recharges too? You can be resistant to enemy fire for so freaking long with this thing. And there he goes. Nice. Alright, this guy, he's gonna activate his shield now. No, he's not. Okay. Let's get killed by enemy 6 because he's really far away from the higher damage rankings. By the way, I also changed the weapons on this thing, right? Everybody is running with Corona and Halo. Why? Because it's the best. Uh, or maybe Storm and Gust is also still pretty good. Um, but I, I decided to just go with a different kind of, you know, weapon set this time. Just to have a little bit of a uh, variety and spice it up somewhat. Okay, got this kill with Quantum Raider. This guy could not finish him because he was in stealth. And I got this kill too. Lots of damage still in the robot, if you see, right? It still does a decent amount of damage, even with these older weapons that are uh, not necessarily the thing you would, you know, would, you know call meta. Um, oh, this time I can't finish him off, but I can start my reload in the meantime. Did he get him right there? Not sure if he did. Yo, I got this kill too. Wonderful, nice. Alright, let's do the quantum radar here. Get this guy. And whoever this is. Okay, he's not... Oh, he, there is his jump. There is his jump coming. And see how fast the phantom is. It's so sick. So fast how you can walk around the corner. I'm waiting for three more seconds until the resistance is back. And, uh, and then this robot has, I think, 33% resistance or 30 and that means we have like 350,000 HP or so that the enemy has to whittle down in order to get us killed. And if you run around like this really fast, the enemy, chances are the enemy's gonna miss a lot of his shots on you um, constantly. He's gonna constantly miss his shots because basically you're you're too fast to be to aiming at to be aimed at uh, reliably. This kill was not mine. Okay, that's a, that's fine. I've gotten all the other kills so far, right? That's a oh man, that's. A, Okay, am I gonna fight really am I gonna really fight this guy? You know what? I'm gonna fight him instead. I'm rather gonna go for him. Even though I'm reloading now, 
At least this guy does not have as much HP as the Fenrir has. The effective HP on this thing is just sick. I think he's also running with the ability right now. He's coming closer. Now he's really hitting with every single shot because, um, you know, he's running shotguns at ultra short range. And I'm reloading my weapon now. The middle, middle one. Okay. Thanks to Last Stand, I was able to survive it. Without Last Stand, that would have probably been a fail and the enemy would have won. Oh man, now this is my improved speed now. Jeez. This is my highest walking speed, even with the ability. Alright, let's uh, let's just hammer away at him. And I think I'm going to be able to even kill him. Because his, his stealth is not useful in this case. Yup, there it goes. And what's left is the Fenrir. Wow, am I surprised to see that the Fenrir is still left and alive. Alright, I'm going to try and walk up to the ramp here to the left. With the resistance though. So let's get him down with his shield. And then try and get this the rest of the robot. We are still having lots of resistance. But we lost the center weapon now. But it was okay because it was reloading anyways. And now we only have these two uh, Tarans. Um, Magnums, sorry. The two Magnums is what we have. So, since he has a repair module, I think the only chance I have maybe... He also is losing weapons. Is run into his shield. Nope, there he goes. No running into this shield. Uh, because he all immediately stopped my movement there. But hey, we almost got him with a really, really downed robot. And he also had a health HP robot. Next time we see him, he's going to be done. All right, look at this huge Lancelot laying around here. Oh, man. These things, you uh, some of you may not know that, but you used to see these things like three or four times in every hangar. Literally every person had it like two or three times in the highest leagues. That was insane. Because it was so... There was no alternative to it. It was just the best. So he did a, he did a good job. He chose, he chose to arrange himself so that his right weapon, the only one where he still can corner shoot with, is, uh, is shootable. And now he's done. So... Oh, he's got a respawn robot. Did you know, by the way, they changed free for all now? You can no longer uh, decide not to spawn in. You no longer have the choice uh, to not spawn in. It will. There is a little t countdown that ticks down, and within like five seconds, it will. It will. It will spawn you in one of your robots. I'm not sure what will happen if you have used all your robots, but you still have res restoration points for one more robot. If you then can choose not to restore. Uh, or if it also then means you can't, uh, you can't have a choice and it will immediately randomly pick one robot and respawn that one. I don't know. Uh, but that's uh, an interesting thing. It means that people can no longer choose not to spawn, no longer stay out of the combat and suddenly be in at the last possible split second. Oh god, this is the Lancelot, man. This is gonna make it a really difficult sh thing to get through. His physical shield is really tough and um, yeah. We're gonna have to somehow get through this thing. His- oh, there we go, we're through. And we're still having the resistance. Do you see how long that resistance lasts? It is so sick. Now I can corner shoot him a little bit. For as long as my resistance is recharging. Or I just come out and whoop him. That's also something I can do. Boom. Nice. I even went through the full Lancelot. And isn't it ridiculous that this slight robot- It's like a light robot, isn't it? That this thing is actually stronger and more tanky than the Lancelot now. I don't know if that's really... I mean, it's really obvious that this is not correct. It should, The Lancelot should outbrawl, with the same weapon setup even, uh, outbrawl this light counterpart. But it can't, because this light robot is so much newer and therefore so much better. And with this new pilot, you have 20% longer on the duration of this ability. And that that is really the point where I ask, okay, is that really supposed to happen? Are you really supposed to have this long of a ability? Um, it may be possible that, I'm have, that I have to quit this video earlier. Because I'm ac expecting someone to ring at my door uh, and bring a new refrigerator. <laughs> That's actually about to happen in a few minutes. Um, but I I wanted to still show you a little bit of Beacon Rush. So I'm jumping in with this robot first. And maybe we make it only as far as this robot gets destroyed. And that's going to be it for Nen. And the video is going to be over. Um, but if the, uh, the door ringer is not ringing in time. Then 
I will be able to play this match till the end. Alright, so, lots of enemies here, way too many enemies, uh, but at the same time, I'm gonna have to do something here. And right now, this is not very smart, because I'm playing without my resistance. I'm playing without the damage resistance, and that's not how you play this thing. I'm gonna finish off the Spectre here, get this guy destroyed, and then I'm gonna try and get back into safety if possible. And I keep my resistance up, so I can fire it more with more health and survivability, but that was already it. Okay, hmm. I expected to do a bit more, but it was in the end like a 3 or 4 on, on me. So, okay, let's go here and get this guy out of the match. Okay, there we go. Three really quick kills with this Storm Leech. Jesus, dude. That is so insane. These four storms are just ridiculous how much damage they pump out. And you see they didn't even want to spawn here anymore. They decide not to spawn here. They're like, no, screw that. I'm not going to fight that thing. Okay, but someone could be now. Someone could spawn here. There he is. Boom, 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 kill. <laughs> oh man, I didn't even use my ability for that. So I need to walk out now because I'm having my ability currently leeching. And you see how he noticed I wait a minute. This is ju just storms, but I have to jump immediately now. I can no longer wait. Okay, I think I can hit him a little bit, but not a lot. Oh my god, how many godlikes can one have in just a few seconds? Alright, we're leeching away at him. His ability is gonna end now. And his ability is too. Godlike, godlike, okay. I actually managed to get them both because of the leech damage. And here we go. Dude, this is just insane. This is not even fun anymore. But this is like, this is like easy mode plus 1000. Like there's, what is anybody gonna do about this? So much durability, so much damage output, relatively good mobility itself. How are you gonna ever freaking survive this? That's way too much damage output. And then, and then the survive, oh, wait, 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 wait. I'm leeching at someone and I'm having the, the damage resistance currently up. But I'm also suppressed at the same time. So that's not not ideal. And I'm dead. He leeched at somebody. Le did he leech at himself? I'm gonna, I just got a, a message. What was that? Okay. That was something else. Um, I guess we're gonna jump here. Yeah, this is a good spot. And we can hit that, that guy really hard. Oh my god, he made it. He made it immediately. Wow. Great job, boards. Great job. He hit me with the first suppression shot. The first one already made a perfect hit. And I just used my Quantum Raider, so I'm completely boned. I'm completely boned against this guy. And I also used my, my, my stealth. I used all everything I have on this robot. Everything that allows me to survive and not die immediately, I used. Okay. Okay, he's done. Nice. We still have all three weapons. That's interesting. And he's almost done. Uh-oh. <laughs> Two more. Two more our chuns are flying in. Oh, uh, you know what I'm going to do? Once they land, I'm going to have so much fun with them. Hold on. And hi. Boom, 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 boom. Yep, that's the gust. So he's now suppressed. By the way, this is still one of the toughest robots in the game here. Um, the little Blitz robot. It's sick how strong this thing is. It's like... It's like the mini Leech, kind of. Or, if you will, it's the mini Fenrir. I think I, there's a time when I called this the mini Fenrir, actually. Um, but this video is not about the Fenrir or the Blitz or the, uh, the Leech. It's about the, um, the Phantom with the ability of 20% longer stealth. No. Uh, ability duration and there is the question like do you think uh, That's an overpowered ability because I must say I do think it is I do believe it is I don't think that the blitz robot should be getting such an ability because It's all no not the blitz. Sorry uh, the phantom robot 
because it's already way too long. Like, the ability already lasts so long that <laughs> they should rather go back on the ability duration than increasing it as as the, the, the resistance, the speed, the firepower is still pretty good. And then you have this teleport as a special feature too. Like, how much are you going to give one robot? By the way, we did just did 22 kills. How much are you going to give one robot, you know? And uh, my, my, my thing is that although, of course, yeah, it's fun to get a legendary pilot and, and, and a cool ability on it. Um, but maybe the ability duration was too long to begin with. So that, you know... That's, I guess, my kind of kind of my point. But I still wanted to show it to you. So, um, yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, leave a like and comment down below. And if you haven't already, hit subscribe as brutal as a man can hit for more. Thanks for bearing with me. You guys are awesome as always. Money Gaming signing off.